What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. I am back again with another video and as y'all can tell from the title of today's video I'm gonna be doing a version of a video that I've done once before and that is a base tour as I said I've done this video about a year ago. It was about a year ago today that I released my base tour video which performed fairly well But my base has changed a little bit since then So I thought I'd go ahead and give you all an updated base tour if you guys do enjoy the video Make sure to leave a like as well as subscribe and with that said, let's go ahead and get right into the video. So over here, I got like a little trophy-ish room. Uh, this is where I just put, I have my bookshelf in here that's got the CDs and the cards. This can't be broken, so I'm really not worried about it getting broken. But this is just kind of like a small little side-off area for stuff that, like I got my radio over here. I can change my skin and my skins over here and all that, but that's over here. And then real quick, I'm going to probably speed up this section of the video. This is the bike skins. I actually have a lot of the bike skins in the game, so... It's something I've been working on and did pretty good at, if I do say so myself. Uh, moving on to the main part of the base, I have this chest over here, which is my dump chest. Basically, if whenever I'm like doing Bunker Alpha or doing a raid or something, and I come back, I'll just put the stuff in there. If I don't feel like putting it where it belongs, and then later in the day, I'll take the stuff from this box and actually put it where it belongs. And moving on over here, I got this chest. It's just got blueprints and a couple miscellaneous stuff. Um, I got my Glocks. And then this is like the Genesis box. I got my Genesis guns, uh, basically the stuff that I'd get from the lab or need for the lab. Um, this is stuff like weapons that are kind of eh, like shotguns, shotguns aren't eh, but like shotguns, machine guns, fast firing weapons and grenades. Um, over here I got melees and then over here I have AKs, scars and VSS Ventoreses. Even there I got this room which is just the recycler. Now uh, behind it I have a chest of stuff that needs to be recycled. This is my rares box. I got like C4s, stuff that you don't typically see like bike armor, uh, the guitar, snorkel masks. There's some pretty cool stuff in here like the uh, B complex I don't think you can get anymore. That medical mask you can't get anymore. That was like a 2020 thing. Then over here I got aluminum stuff, wire, bars, bauxite. Uh, moving over I got iron, nails, plates, all that stuff. Um, this is the stuff like chopper stuff, and then over here, paint, got a little bit of that. Meds, and then this is like the big stuff you need to upgrade, like ash, I got a bunch of that. Carbon composite, steel, kind of the higher end stuff for level 4 and level 5 walls, and then upgrading. Uh, and then this room I got a small armory, you just got boots, pants, shirts, hats, the basics. Uh, moving on from that main part of the base, I'll go ahead and go over here, these are my furnaces. And then also my um, fireplaces. To, this is like the charcoal main area. I'm moving over here. I got my gunsmith bench. And then this is the uh, spare parts area. I got a couple miscellaneous boxes. Like there's tape. Bolts. Wires. Wires. Bearings. I got a lot of glue. Quite a few engine parts. And then moving on to here. I got just limestone. Limestone bricks got wood and I got some ash so this is like the main wood area over here I have like those special storages there's a lot more stuff in here like there's about 2,000 transistors in here a thousand wires there's a lot more aluminum bars in here and then this is like the tool stuff this one actually is one of my favorites because it's I do not like storing a bunch of batteries because they seem kind of useless but now this gives me like a good place to store them where it doesn't feel like I'm wasting room and then I got my drone, got a little bit more iron, that's mainly charcoal, just sand. Moving on over here, this is going to be my trophy room. Um, I'm not, that's what the plan for it is, I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to do with it yet. The plan is for it to be a trophy room, but this was where my ATV is, but since I've gotten the ATV, it's just been one big empty room. So we'll see what I end up doing with this. Moving on, we got just leather and thick fabric, so stuff for like making armor. Um, we got a fishing box, we got acid right next to the acid bath, um, we have this warehouse that has a lot more stuff that I use for upgrading walls. So like you'll see a bunch more iron and bricks in here, this also helps with storage so I don't have it all my boxes at the base full of stuff that could easily be stored in here. Uh, then I have a main kitchen area of my base, it's a kitchen, there's food, I got the fridge, I got the stove, I got a bedroom area over to the left, and then this is kind of like a hangout area, just like no, really per no real purpose, but you can just chill over here. And then over here I got extra furniture that I have that I might end up putting in the trophy room. We'll see. And then over here I, I got food and dogs. I got these little stands over here. And then here's the dog crate. Got dogs in here. I got 
took so long to get the true friend and I was actually able to get a husky true friend which is honestly much more impressive. I also got a Rottweiler up in there. I got a Corgi that brings me a free coin every day so I do enjoy the dogs. And then I'm going to speed this part up of the video but here's the inbox. And then real quick I'll go ahead and move over to the settlement. Nothing too terribly crazy. Got this extra little storage from all expeditions that I have just in case. I need it for like the settlement or need to bring it to the base. It's just extra storage and stuff I've gotten over here. And anyway that's the video guys. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did make sure to leave a like on the video as well as subscribe. It's free and you can always change your mind later. Let me know what you guys thought of the base down in the comments below. Uh, also, you can join the Discord. Link for that will be in the description to paste your own base. And maybe people there can rate it. Anyway, I'm not going to take up much more of y'all's time. I hope you guys all have an amazing rest of y'all's day. I'm out. Peace.